hi guys welcome back again to my channel thank you so much for finding time once again karibuni sana if you are a new subscriber kindly make sure you subscribe to this channel turn on your notification and make sure you give this video a thumbs up and welcome to the v's family today i want to take you through something that i have gotten or i, I got uh, during my uh just talking around talking uh, to people more about mtumba and uh there's something that came up and uh, before i even go ahead uh, i know you watched the video uh for the lady called sharon the one who picks cameras so i just want you guys to support her what you know akona these beautiful shots you can see this type of shots also they come from the boy shots bell you can see he she has sorry she has very beautiful uh, shorts please go and support her and uh, she's selling them at 200 shillings you can see they're so beautiful so if you are in kitale opposite m oriental bank ask for shiro and you'll get her there so uh, i just wanted also for you to know that uh, this type of shorts also are found in the boy shorts bell so for those people who have been asking me the beach shorts is in a particular hapo now i have uh, maybe just analyze or maybe gather information to just talk to you about something those people who are picking cameras or you are selecting from different uh bell openers please kindly note that um these people also are there to make you not to grow in some way i can say that because first of all they cannot disclose where they get bills that is one thing and uh, they they usually lie more about uh the price the price of the bills so that you feel so scared not to buy third thing is um first of all if they know that uh you depend on cameras they sell the cameras at an expensive price now what is the solution to all this open your bills please stop being afraid of opening bills open your bills and you'll save a lot of money you find that you're spending 15000 20000 to shop actually when i was talking to sharon behind um the cameras on the, maybe before we started recording she said there's a time during the december season uh, somebody had opened the children dress the one i usually sell you for 28k and the lady said uh, she bought the the, the bell for 40,000 of which I have been in this Mtumba business. There is no children bell or a children bell that goes for 40. The highest I have had, it is 32,000. And um, so she's, she bought the dresses for 30K. Imagine, Ebu imagine, Uya Momuzia, cameras na 30,000. Okay, she said that she had recovered the capital and also got the profits. But do you see that that one person has already bought uh, has already bought uh, another bell for this seller? So there is something also, if you're selecting cameras, that, that is why I usually tell you guys, watch any kukua comfortable maliuko. Una select nguo, don't be comfortable. Find that courage and open bills because you find you're spending a lot. And hautategemea huyo mwenye unachukua kwake mizigo ama cameras akwambie ivy hapa ndo natuanga bell ivy ile label inaitwa ivy ivy these things they will not tell you in fact tabia yenye kosoko when they open the bells they hide the labels now i don't know why kwa nini wanakuanga nayo perception that is jumtu atenda atafute hiyo mzigo and remember mzigo yako na ya mwingine haizifanana and labels are different so kwa wale watu you are selecting cameras please any get out of that comfort zone i know you have you have been in that business for a while and umuona fruit, fruits za za hiyo biashara ku select cameras but it is time for you to take a bail because if you calculate the amount of money that you use to buy uh those pieces it is just equivalent for you to even get two bells and you know there are bells that really have good stuff for example for the summer light if you're if you're sorry if you're if if you're dealing with children bells or children clothes summer light is a good bell it has cameras what you just do because maybe you should select cameras 
take the, the, the cameras from the bell, the pieces that remain peleka soko. It is just, and even though you just grow. So don't expect these people to tell you the exact price that they get the bells. Don't expect them to show you where they get the bells. Because once they know they, they share that information, you're not going to buy. And they're going to lose a customer like you. So also, si sita la umu wa mtu menyanakuzia because ametumia akili. Ametumia akili, that is why ameweka wengi wenu ama wetu tuliwekwa in eh, tunachagua cameras sababu ya uoga ya kuchukua bills. So be, oh, of course umtu si eti hajawahi fungua beli kamtokea vibaya ama imekuwa fair. Of course kuna ile bill yenye amefungua ikam disappoint. But haizi kwa hiyo biashara kama haina pesa. Have you ever seen biashara hakuna kila mahali but mtu atafungua su, ataenda afungua asubuhi, atafunga late in the evening because huo mtu anajua hiyo pesa. Ya yeah, yani pesa kwa hiyo biashara iko. And Mimi naombianga mtumba iko na pesa. Hakuna biashara iko na pesa kama mtumba acha niwaambie. Because you can find ini kama tu tuseme it's like tunacheza um, uh, it's like you are just betting. I'm going to buy I'm going to buy uh, ngu maybe ya so takuja niuze 200. So I have 100 there and bado nimebaki na pesa ya ku bet. So it is just a mindset that you also have to take. Take with you. Think outside the box. Because saizi kama haufikiri ya the box, my dear, you will still be picking clothes for the next coming years. So it is time for you guys to spread your wings. I am not, I am not discouraging anyone. Na siambi wala tupia wanapiananga cameras ni wabaya, but I am just helping some of you guys because there are stories out here. If you can spend 30,000 just on one bail and you are not even, it's not the bail that you bought. It is a bell that you're selecting the cameras. And the children dress, most of them, I can just say like 97% of the children dress have cameras. So if kama umetumia 30,000 kunua those type of dresses, usha lipa, wewe mtu moja, umesha lipa, uwe mama mzigo yake nyamifungua. Then these other ones, sasa anatafla to profit pole pole. So, and you also see, okay, sisi kata, kuna wanyi wako comfortable kupik hivyo. But I'm just, I, I just want you guys to open your minds. You can budget at uh, around 15,000. Save the 5K that you, yani umeku na tumia 20. Save 5, munuwa beli ya 15. That is how we think outside the box in this business. Same with you. Sababu, hakuna ile siku nye uta, uta amka tu seme, atimi am comfortable. Like you, you had Sharon, she said if she has an opportunity, she will advance. And we talked because, and I feel that um, uh, it's, it is just the grace of God because when I was doing the content creation on that day, I had passed a lot of, uh, I can say, stands and I went to her. But you know, also for her also, she, she was saying that she was on a call, alafika katika. So you see how God works. And we talked in length. And she said she never knew the Isabel of 15,000. She never knew the Isabel of 19. She she didn't even know the Isabel of Duves that are, are, are ranging at 15K. So there is, yani we think that we know, but there's so many people here, they're even dealing with this type of businesses, but they don't know the exact place to take those bills. They don't know the exact right suppliers. For example, you had, I will connect her with some few uh, suppliers. It means... Some, sometimes there are things that maybe others need that we don't have. So that is where other suppliers come in. And remember, in this uh, industry, in this Mtumba industry, we help each other. We have different labels, and some of them, they come the same, some come different. But it doesn't mean if I if I don't have something, I can just stay in relax. I don't I don't have to go and look uh, uh, to other suppliers. If you have good relations and which you should have with other suppliers because there is a time maluna tegemea companies zimwage mziko hazimwagi. But if you know somebody who knows somebody, through somebody, imagine you are going to get bills. Instead ya kukana bills na kuka, kukana store haina bills. And also for those people who are uh, maybe in this journey, they also want to, uh, they also want to start supplying. I want also to guide you through. I'm going to do a video so, so that you guys can understand. You don't need millions. You don't need, uh, you know, start small. 
you can start small and it will just take time also patience and bd passion pia ya biashara it helps a lot so i hope i've uh, maybe enlightened you on something because i felt so bad when we were talking with Sharon I was like oh this is a lot of money that uh, she's she's not to, i cannot say wasting but it is uh, it is somehow um maybe if she knew earlier they, maybe she would have saved around 15000 you know because just shopping for pieces camera pieces for an amount that is that large 30000 that is not small cash you guys especially for cameras the moment when i'm nulia mzigo by the amemlisha sana but um, me being this i have to me lazima nikuchanue kwa hii industry lazima ukae ukiwa ume umefungua macho you have to stay a lot yani things are changing out here so you also have to move with the speed and na na time vile na change because it will reach a time utaka Will you still be there watu wana grow wewe uko tu kwa ile comfort zone yako so please get out of your comfort zone and do business so thank you so much i appreciate your support i appreciate everything that you have uh, been any through your kind words through your comments your likes i appreciate keep on subscribing and i will see you on the next video bye guys